Hey guys, welcome back to Total Warhammer, Total Dwarf, uh, which is what we're running on right now. Uh, interesting. Didn't realise we'd got to the point where we could do that, but yes, yes, we will do that. Uh, and yes, yes, we will do that. We've got great growth going on as well. So next turn is when we're going to go and have that fight. Hooray, hurrah. Huzzah, huzzah. Uh, once we can get the uh, Thunderers, then shit is going to get off popping. Thunderers are nasty. Uh, so, close ally of ours, an inf influential Dawi sitting on several guild councils. Shame his family name with Craven Axe. He should, by all accounts, take the Slayer Oath, go into exile, but we will lose his influence. Uh, make him take the oath. Shameful display. Minus public order. Oh, I don't mind being at, at odds with the uh, Zephbar. Alright, let's go. Ready. Man, dwarves are slow. Okay. Uh, okay. Eh. Nihu. Not sure what the bloody spear's are doing right now, to be honest. Huh? <coughs> Pardon me. My apologies. Masterwork crossbows. Yes, we will get that. Okay, now we take the fight. And my word, we are just apparently over prepared for this. Uh, King must make his way through the underway, an area under the domin dominion of the of Urx and Groby. Be wary of side passages, for it stinks of an ambush, even if the Everpeak Air Corps is en route to offer you assistance. And I'll be quiet for this. March on, brave Dowie! March on! To the cursed realms of the Groby we go! I know not what mischief they cause, but they're up to something, for my beard itches with trouble. We take the underway, these ancient highways, built by dwarf hands! Give us the best chance of approaching swiftly, catching the green skins unawares. Let us not dawdle, for there are grudges to settle, and new entries in the Damas Cron to write. Book of Grudges, I'm guessing, is... Oh, hello. Um, so yeah, they've, there's going to be some... Uh, how far? Okay, so I reckon what we want to do is we want a full-on line of dwarf warriors like so, and then we want a line of our quarrelers like so. I like you know like the the joke the the kind of dwarf thing is always being you know like they they they're always arguing, and then you have got quarrelers sitting about place and I guess the grudge throwers like if we just put them here like so they'll have a pretty decent range yeah I'm not complaining about that uh, at all and then we'll have our high king right there he does have hold of the line now which gives us uh, rally sorry which gives us plus 12 leadership so if we see, see people kind of going down we can deal with that. How is our range here? Just out. They seem to be moving forward. So yeah, they, they've got a shaman. I like, I like, I like, it's interesting how he doesn't... Are you guys... Oh. Okay, so we need to probably move them over this way. The problem with uh, with the dwarves is like, yeah, they're armored and everything, but the goblin archers can really do a number on them. Guys, can you uh... actually, you guys, just go in on them, maybe? There you go, that'll do. I mean goblins, orcs, gob orcs, goblins, whatever. 
And you can see, like, the, the pure volume that the... The pure volume that the, uh, the goblins fire can be very problematic. These goblins really not, uh... Really not a problem for us, though. Uh, can we reach? We cannot reach those quite. Okay, that's a shame. No spears either to like receive the the wolf rider charge, which is a bit of a shame, but kind of understandable, I guess. What the? No. No. Need to be firing on them, please. Okay, so yeah, you on them. You on them for now. Then we've got our allies coming in to deal to these uh, ba bastard goblins. Not sure what those miners were doing. Ow. That really does hurt quite hard. Okay. So in you go. And those explosions are... Well, they're hurting them pretty hard, I'd say. Okay. Yep. You guys take them. You guys, uh, go after them. Uh, you know what? Go after, go after them. You guys go after them. You guys go after them. Yeah, this this is pretty much them done already, I guess. Uh, well, fairly simple fight, honestly. So you two on them please uh, and these guys are just running away so let's move them up uh, let's move th them yeah sure let's move them up it's, it's not that big a deal anymore um, and we'll charge in on the shaman 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 are those trolls? Yeah, there is. Uh, how about you guys go and deal with those trolls, please? Forgot that trolls would be coming in. Dangerous little bastards they are. Dangerous big bastards, actually. If we had some troll slayers, ooh, baby. Even some giant slayers. Man, the giant slayers are awesome. Uh, uh, also, maybe you go and help deal with that shaman uh, dude. Yeah? Thank you. Ah, oh, there we go. Getting some decent, uh, yeah, some decent hits in. Is that the shaman running? Uh, kind of. Kind of. Let's bring the crawlers forward. There you go. Just up there will do for now. Uh oh. We may need to, yeah, these guys. Okay, so... Bring these guys around here. Round, round, round. Charge, charge, charge. Sneaky stabbing is a lot better than I, I gave it credit for to begin with. Uh, how are we doing here? How's the shaman doing? Eh. Let's bring the these guys. I really wish, like, it's one of the things that annoys me is, like, they don't... They don't properly lap or overlap, I guess, with the things they should overlap with, really. Might might as well just bring uh, bring Thorgrim in. I'm gonna activate that just to hit everyone with some like good feelings. Uh, but yeah, I guess we should run these guys just straight at this. Uh, although they're running now, so that's good. And I assume. The trolls, yeah, should just about be running. 
They get scared very easily. Boom! Wow. Okay. Uh, they all die, regardless. If you get caught in an underway battle, uh, everyone dies. Which could be really interesting for the Skaven, because I think they'll always be using the underways, basically. And we, we only lost like 100 or so people, which is also good. Also very good. Gets us some armor. Not, not going to complain about that. Oh, gets us the potion of tough, toughness, which is one use, but is really, really good. And the dragon helm, so... Yeah, let's see. Do we want to give the dragon helm to you? We can do, but I don't think we need to. Like, just that little bit of armor is not going to make that much difference. Uh, let's get... Uh, what do we have? Aura size, longbeards, hammerers, ironbreakers, slayers. We don't need that yet. Iron Drake's cannon, again, we don't need that yet. Armor for gyrocopter, gy again, we don't need that yet. So... I feel like we work on either this. Iron Wield gives us wound recovery. Lightning strike battles when reinforcements are present. I don't know what, exactly what a light, lightning strike battle is. Uh, ambush defense chance. Casualty replenishment rate. Attrition. And then research rate. You know, it's, it's decent. I think... I think what I want to do right now is go uh, melee defense, hit points. Uh, unless. Ah. Leadership. Let's get that leadership up, I think. Much better. Okay, and you can just go back this way. I, I don't want to push into here yet. And I think this. I don't know who would be out here. Like, because you can see there's a whole load of map up here. A whole load of map. Uh, maybe Skaven? And then down here would be the Kemri. Uh, maybe the uh, Lizardmen. The Slan, is it? I'm, I'm unsure of uh, what... And then I guess over here would probably be the, the Dark Elves. And there's the High Elves and Wood Elves as well. I'll have to look, I'll have to look at a map. And I'll look at a map and then I'll come back and be like, this is exactly what these things are and mean and where they... Where they reside and all that kind of thing uh i think what we want to do is we probably want to head down this way and start taking some of these mountain areas i think this is a great start and it would lead us into uh some well it'd lead us into some fightiness with the green skins now wouldn't it which isn't the worst thing that could possibly happen i think the dwarves may as, as i said before i think the dwarves may be one of the easier races to deal with maybe that's just me but don't even know what they're doing at this point i'm a little scared to ask all right uh, so let's head down this way we might want to just, uh, mm. no rush right now, but, right, that's upgrading, that's fine. What we probably do want is we probably do want another army, however. Uh, there's a wog. Crap. This is why you don't let... Orcs win, guys. Because then you have a wog. Okay, so... Armory would unlock quite a fair few things. The Slayer Shrine would, however, unlock the Slayers with the use, obviously, of an armory. Um, I don't think we specifically need the Engineer's Workshop right now. Because it'll be a little bit of time before we can get the Iron Drakes and uh, the Organ Gun. Anyway. That gives us the Cannon and Thunderers, right? So, I think we maybe go for this. And then, on the rank up, we take the Armoury as well. And then there's the Great Hall. So, that would give us limited-ish options. Yeah, we totally want to... Uh, 
upgrade that. Uh, yeah, let's go. Let's go with the armory. Armory makes sense to go for first because we can't get the slayers anyway. And the only reason it would make sense. Um, I just need to check this, dude. Yeah, so runes, strike the runes. The damping uh, decreases the reserves for the thingy me, thingy me of thingy me's. Uh, and then you go to like there. Okay. Let's see if we can get some trading going on, shall we? Uh, Zephar, how do you feel about us? Eh, not too bad. You may speak before uh, my shield bearers, bearers, and on the you, earth still. Uh, okay, so we, we're already trading. So who are we trading with? Literally just them. Okay. Uh, no, we're, we're not even trading with... Are we? No. Why can't we trade with... So we've got a defensive alliance and military access. Uh, so we are trading with them. We're not trading with them, My which means... Ready. Do uh, not me. Why can't we... Offer them a trade. Do we need a non-aggression pact first? Okay. How about you guys? No. Okay. Uh, may oh, maybe we... No, because we... Yeah, we, we definitely have to be... Um, next to them, I think. Huh. Don't know. Interesting. Rulers tolerance to dwarves. They condemn great power. Yeah, fucking great powers. Am I right? Uh, okay. Turn. So I think what we'll do is we add him in because a runesmith's going to be very useful, especially against like the shamans, the shamans, shamans, sh shaman shamans, bugman grudge, beheld in Grimnir's seething sight, Bugman Brewery was once created full brew houses. So we have to defeat armies belonging to Greenskins, basically. As soon as possible, the sooner the better. So we're going to use the underway to go literally nowhere. Aha! Don't know why that happened. Uh, are we? Yeah, we're using the underway. So let's just use it to go here. Uh, and then that'll be fine for now. We need to research, so let's check it out. Uh, income from settlements. We don't really need it right now. Diplomatic relations with all factions would be nice. Uh, leadership would probably be better. Plus ammunition is fine. Unit experience would be good. But we're not going to get in time anyway. So I think we go for the Dwarven Resolve. And then probably we'll go for the diplomats after that. Okay. Uh, end turn. End turn. Okay. Uh, shit. Green skin's getting big. Black Venom have been... Teef Snatcher has been obliterated. Faction is encountered. Okay. So the Greenskins have that, 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 that. They really don't like us. Uh, the Bloody Spears have not joined them, however, so that's good. So what we want to do, and don't be an annoying butthole about this, okay? Go and join them. There we go. Yep. Uh, we still appear to be in the place. So let's go down this way. Uh, we can't recruit in this stance. And we have a... Okay, yeah. So next turn, we can get some guns if we want, and also cannons. Uh, which is something we should really consider, because they're strong as hell. It would probably actually be worth... Uh, yeah, so building constructed. Oh, armory as well. Nice. So what can we recruit now? Oh, let's have a, you need to be quiet a little bit, mister. Uh, so maybe some dwarf warriors with great weapons. The minor blasting charges is a little bit like, meh. Yeah. Not as important. I think we get rid of that grudge thrower. Yeah. 
take a cannon. Uh, we take two dwarf warriors with great weapons. Get rid of those quarrelers. Uh, get rid of those quarrelers. Take two of those guys. How much space do we have? We have space. We have space. Uh, take out those two guys, and then we put in another cannon, because we want cannons. And then we put those guys in like that, and then we've got that. Now, we could get rid of the miners. Uh, you know what? Fuck the miners. I'm not that interested in having the miners. Uh, we could actually take miners for blasting charges. Which would be really good. Because <clears throat> they they can decimate a unit. Uh, almost any unit, actually. Um... I mean, quarrelers with great weapons would be nice, but do we need them? Probably not. Let's take a turn. Let's take a turn. Time for a reckoning. So we've got two, uh, two dwarf warriors with great weapons. <clears throat> these guys are going to be like the punching power because these guys are shielded so there will be charged defense against large foes. Oh, didn't realize that. That's nice. Um, so these guys will be, kind of be like a punching power as opposed to... Like these guys do damage. These guys armor piercing and armored. Uh, whereas these guys are armored and shielded and charged defense against large foes. So they're going to be the defensive, take the hit, and then the rest will go in. <clears throat> so... They doing? They're encamped. Okay. Take one more turn. Uh, also, I didn't notice and uh, didn't do anything about the fact that we got some population Final surplus. Delay. Hey, military alliance to pay us? Sure, sure. I'll have a chat with them. Uh, they should be better. Uh, what's it called when when you're good like thing? You know? Yeah, much better than good thing. Move to there. Two cannons and a grudge thrower. We could probably get rid of that grudge thrower. Oh, most likely. Okay, so let's have a look. So we can upgrade this. We can also upgrade this. There's no reason not to upgrade that. Or that. And maybe take a... Well, that thing is right there. And that, that could be a problem. So let's take a guardhouse, I think. And also, why not, really? Um, so with the next upgrade we need four and we're on two. So we could upgrade this, which will give us another space. Why do we need to though? That's the question right now. We don't really. We really don't really. Um, okay, so, uh, do, 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 do. we want the Dwarven Diplomats, the Oath Stones and all that stuff is pretty good though. Um, and du, 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 du. we do want to at some point go down off Black Crag. Huh. That's random. Well, let's trade. We've got a trade with Barrack Far. Oh, wait. Cannot trade. A route to their capital cannot be established. Okay, so the bloody spears are basically in the way. Oh, fair enough. Okay, guys, so I think that'll be the end of the episode, because in the next turn, we will be fighting those bastards, and we probably will be taking that spot. Uh, so look forward to it. Hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. It always helps me out a lot, and I do really appreciate it. And I will see you in the next one.